For Nigeria to attain its agricultural potentials and food security, stakeholders in the sector have been taxed to ensure collaboration with all relevant actors, especially our institutions of learning. The Commissioner of Agriculture in Ogun State, Dr. Adiola Odedino, admitted the disclosure of this while delivering a public lecture at the Achievers University, Owo, Ondo State. A correspondent, Shagun Falomo, sent in this report. The Food and Agriculture Organization, FAO, has projected that about 25.3 million people in Nigeria would face acute food insecurity during the June to August 2023 lean season. A quarterly report released by the global organization shows that the figure projected is higher than the 19.45 million forecast in 2022. Delivering his paper on agricultural development and food security in the 21st century Nigeria, challenges and prospects, Odedina posits that this is high time all stakeholders show deliberate efforts in ensuring that the nation avoids depending food insecurity. Uh, being agriculture, being law, being civil, you look up to the university people. We also want university students when they graduate uh, to enter the landscape of agriculture. You've heard that the university is establishing a center for development in agriculture. They are also going into farming. They want to start agriculture. And it's going to start by talking to people. It's going to start with infrastructure. So the university, um, I agree with them that they are going to be working with a lot of stakeholders and collaborators to develop agriculture, to make agriculture attractive to young people, starting from within. So this lecture is about uh, talking about challenges in agrarian development, how we can solve it, and how uh, we can cope with the uh, present challenge. Odedina says that the internal mechanism must be put in place in tertiary institutions to prepare students for jobs and wealth creation in agriculture while citing practicable practice. He adopted the provost of Federal College of Agriculture, Akure Ondo State. Will it please? the acting vice chancellor of the university professor omolola imuyi in our welcome address says the research and innovation are needed in agriculture to drive increased food production with emphasis on nutritional value as well as reduce food loss and waste with less environmental damage this lecture was arranged by Chivas university to further series of actions to advance research and innovation capacity building of farmers with the aim of providing a private sector support to agricultural development and food security. We propose to collaborate with government, non-governmental organizations through linkages, collaboration and partnership. Meanwhile, the Pro Chancellor of the institution, Bode Ayorinde, explains that the problem of unemployment in the country should prepare proprietors of universities to introduce the youth into a Greek economy problem of unemployment in the country should inform proprietors of universities to introduce our youth early into our Greek economies. If they leave this place with their BSc whatever and they are distanced to our traditional engagement, which